Hello, old friends and new strangers. Welcome back to Vega Playing Quench. <sighs> Y'all, it has been a trial to get this episode out. If it's not working, what I'm doing right now, I'm like, I'm gonna rip my hair out because <sighs> there's just been so many te technical difficulties. I'm not gonna bore you with it. The point is, we're back playing this game. We are where we left off. I did have to replay this level because a cutscene triggers at the end of it, which I didn't know about, and there's no other way to trigger it. it. It will not trigger if you just start at the next level. So we are back here. Nothing really changed, just kind of the same drill. Um, but yeah, that's about it. I, I have tried to record this episode so many times, and each time something happens, so I really hope this is working because I'd really like to get this out for y'all. Let's go ahead and get started. Shepherd's egg fruit for a second gift. A single baobab seed. Excuse me, an offering for the Eastern elder tree. On the first day, Shaman taught Shepherd to fly. Uh-oh. Never mind, we're back. How to master both sky and land. The elephant tribe passed through the grazing lands. and bid their ancestors grant them safe travel. Instead came a warning. Spirits, smoke beasts, were roaming the Eastland. By moonlight, the elephant tribe crossed the fragile bridge from Westland to Eastland, across the sea that stretched between. The herd was chased by spirit and flood, but Shepard guided them to safety. Yay, we did it. I did not do any blowing waves, but apparently that's a thing we can do, maybe. Okay, so that's the cutscene. It's not that important, but I wanted to include it just for the sake of having it there. <laughs> the next level is called Grazing the Velt. Scout warns Shaman of the strange smoke beasts that have overtaken the Velt. Will Shaman reach headlong before the Springbok move on? Those dark figures, they must be the smoke beasts Scout spoke of. Shepard, maybe you can distract them or lead them away? Okay. So doesn't give me any hints of how to do that. Look, they're really cute though. I wish I could tilt the camera because I want to get a look at it. It's cute, but it has little glowing angry red eyes. I want to be his friend. How do I make them my friend? It's not, of course, not giving me any hints. I'm gonna go ahead and do this grove though so I can get more rain. There's this valley there. Some rocks. Let's get more wind. That's some kind of resting place. Maybe? I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do with it. Is that it? Something happened, so yes, I'm gonna say that that was it. <laughs> then we've got the edge of the map. Another place that needs to be rained on. So these guys are on fire. So I guess maybe we're supposed to rain on them? Maybe? Oh, look at all the spring box. Look, oh, they're cute. Look at their little faces. 
Oh, okay, and then one more thing to rain on. Okay, so apparently wind and lightning are what it wants me to use based on that. So these guys, I think I can trap these guys in, in this cavern if I time it right, which hopefully I've done. Oh, okay, so earthquaking them stuns them. I don't know what that means. Are they trapped? I hope they're trapped. I have no idea what to do with this guy though. Like, it's really <laughs> not clear. Are they stuck? Please be stuck. Please don't find a way out. Please be stuck. I missed that one. Okay, now we're out of quake and almost out of rain. So we're gonna have to do not those things. Okay, so show me what are my options. I only have one option. I have to go here. So I have to pass this guy. I'm gonna try s lightninging him. Maybe he'll get set on fire? Okay, lightning pet set the poor cinder stack on fire. So that did. No, 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 what was that? What the. What? Fiery smoke beasts die and leave pollution behind. Oh. So it died, but it did that thing first. I don't really understand what that was about. <laughs> These guys appear to still be trapped. So I think we're safe to go to the next point. Yeah, I don't see anybody there. Please stay, please stay, please stay, please stay, please stay. Do not chase me, do not chase me. Oh, he's trying. I can see his little antlers twitching. He's trying. Don't chase me. Okay, yeah, it worked. I'm proud of myself. He needs to really give you better hints. I would very much appreciate better hints. The thing I find funny is none of these elephants have Shaman's little head marking on them. Also, yes, I know you can pronounce it like Shaman. They're both correct, as far as I can tell, and I have looked extensively because it's not clear. Anyway, <laughs> I don't know what to do about this next part. Cause see, we've got two here. We've got a lot of them. Is, okay, where's our next location? Again, we only have one option. So it's to this one. I don't know what to do. I need more hints. I need better hints. Uh. I, I, I think making pollution is probably a bad thing, so I probably shouldn't set them on fire. But I can try raining on them. Oh, rain calms enraged cinder stags. Are they enraged? Oh no, but I did accidentally grow more brambles. Oh, is it stuck in the brambles? Are they stuck? Be stuck, be stuck, be stuck. Oh no, I'm not here, you didn't see me. I'm not here, you didn't see me. No, 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 stop. Okay, so raining on them does work, but you have to time it correctly, I guess. And then, again, we only have one option. What do I have left? It's just wind. What does blowing on them do? I can blow this sand away also. 
Cinder stags can be guided by wind. So are they gonna keep walking that way? Because if they keep walking that way, maybe we can walk past them. I'm not here, you didn't see me. I'm not here, you didn't see me. Don't look, no, 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 no. Don't come, don't come close. Stay, stay over there. No, 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 stay over there. Oh my God, okay. We made it! All right, hold on. I gotta come up with a Springbok voice. Shit. I don't like the one I picked last time. Okay, um, what do Springbok sound like? I guess bouncy, bouncy voices. Shaman, we meet at last. I'm Headlong, I speak for the Springbok. Good timing, too. Almost late. Spotted a band of smoke beasts nearby, just getting ready to move. The crossing was not kind to us, but we traveled as swiftly as we could. It's thanks to Scout that we were able to find you. I hope our haste will not have been in vain. Will the Springbok join the pilgrimage? Would love to, really. My parents used to tell us stories about theirs. It sounded so exciting! But we can't all go. Some have to stay behind, and they've got no good land to live on. Smoke beasts are showing up everywhere, ruining the veld. Up to me to find safe grazing land before the dry. I understand. So some of the Springbok could join us if the rest of the herd had a safe place to graze? Sure, but we can't grow grass from nothing. And even if we could, we can't keep the smoke beasts away. Before the pilgrimage began, the elder tree gave us a precious gift. This is Shepherd, child of the Elder Tree. You'll soon see what they are capable of. Non-binary shepherd, non-binary non shepherd is canon. It's a bird, but whatever, live with me. I could not have gotten us this far without Shepherd's help. A child of the Elder Tree? Amazing! The stories my parents told got nothing on that. Okay, if Shepard can fix this place up, then who am I to break a promise our ancestors made? I don't know what is happening with that. Level completed! Yay! We protected the elephant tribe while we searched for the springbok. Good job, us. Moving on. Oh god, I hope we're still recording. Oh my god. Y'all, you have no idea. It is been... It's been an adventure, but not the fun kind. Okay. Headlong's challenge. Headlong can only join the pilgrimage if their tribe has lands to graze. Headlong is also non-binary, apparently. <laughs> Safe from roaming cinder tag spirits and free of pollution. Okay. Grassland's been overgrazed, dried up. Plus, we've got to keep these smoke beasts away. Shepherd, can you help? Looks like there's two smoke beast herds to keep out and three grazing areas to restore. I'm counting on you. I don't know. I don't know. It's very it's very hard to pick out voices on Do I not have herds? I don't have herds. Okay. Do not destroy any of the smoke beasts. Hold on. Restore the grazing areas. Block off the passages from smoke beasts. Don't kill them. Okay. Yeah, it's very hard to come up with voices on the fly. Like, it's one thing if I know the game. Or at least, or like I'm playing it on my own and I can kind of come up with the voice that I would do for them as I get to know them, but on the fly, it's very hard. Clear sand from well springs before using quake. Okay. That's a wellspring. Goodbye, sand. Oh wait, I have to get quake first. Okay, there's quake. So we do sand again. Go that way. Oh, baby birds eating. I don't know if y'all can hear that. There's little noises in the background. That's baby bird. Okay, so I have quake. So now I can clear this wellspring. spring. 
I like the water filling animations. Oh, and it brought water to that. Okay, so it gave me things when the grass got restored. So I can get the things from the groves not just by raining on them. I can get them by filling reservoirs next to them, <laughs> maybe? Okay, and brambles. That one's easy, I know that one. Western grassland looks good. Thanks, Shep. Cool, so that's one down. I think these ones, this is like the representation of that. Okay, so there's another wellspring. Oh good, I got new things. New things! Oh, okay, so I could get lightning through that. I don't want to go through here. Okay. This is the edge of the map. That one, that one is just sand. Okay, and there's some cinder stags. Okay, so block off passages with what? I need more information! Okay, I have a bunch of rocks, so... Okay. Am I, like, making a landslide? I think that's a thing it said I could do. Oh, apparently that was the right answer, okay. Ah, oh, good! The herd can graze here in peace. Oh. Northern grassland looks ready to graze. Wonderful. Cool. So, oh, look, the spring walks are coming. Oh, they're bouncy. They're coming down from the mountain. Oh, I love them. Look how cute they are. Look how bouncy they are. I love that. That makes me, oh, and there's a really cool waterfall. That's very cool. Everything is triangles. Okay, and then it's just this one. So I guess I have to do this. And then it said South Passage. There's nothing there. Oh, I like the the cloud. Okay, that's a very cool effect that they do to do like end edge of the map mist. I love the like spiral hexes. That's very cool. I don't see a Southern Passage. Oh, there's more rocks over here. Okay. Oh, there they are. I found them. They're really cute. I want them to be okay. <laughs> so I think more rocks. Same same deal. Hopefully. Apparently, yes. Good work, Shepard. Cinder Stags won't be able to get in this way. Southern Craftlands revived. Excellent. Did I do it? Look at the little spring box. Why you guys stop? Come on. <gasps> They're shadows. Oh, I love all the bouncing. I love it. Okay, what am I waiting for? Look, it's pretty now. I like the colors. There's pretty colors. Whole hearts grazing safely. Safely! <laughs> Amazing! Outdid yourself, Shepard. You've got my thanks. And as to your answer for the pilgrimage? Happy to accompany you, of course. Least I can do now. I am grateful to have the aid of the Springbok tribe. We need to seek the Wildebeest tribe next. Has your herd run with them lately? Spotted them at the river three days back. Need to leave now to catch them. We can lead the way. Ah, almost forgot. The offering makes it official. You received a Vigies, Vigies, Vigies flower. I have no idea how to pronounce that. Let's ask Google real quick. 
Let's find because it, it's gonna bother me if I don't know. It, it can't be Vigius. That's like, no Vigius. It, all of these sound wrong. Okay, well, apparently they come from South Africa. Maybe it, this is not telling me how to pronounce them. It's an Afrikaans word. Viggy? Viggy flower? Viggy pronunciation. Viggy. Viggy. Viggy flower. Cool. Now we know. It's a Viggy flower. That was such a fascinating uh, tangent. Level completed! We restored three grazing areas, we blocked off the north and south patches, and we kept all the smoke bees alive. Because nature is balanced, I guess. <laughs> I mean, that's like a good thing. That's a good thing. That's a good message. But, uh, you know, sometimes I just want to kill things. But that's why I play more than one game at once. I have my nice peaceful game to have the nice peaceful part of me. And then I have my murder game, which right now is Assassin's Creed Syndicate. Which I've been having some issues with, but what else is new? All right. Across the river, Shaman and Headlong lead their tribes to the eastern belt, hoping to find Grizzle her n and ask the Wildebeest to join them. The Wildebeest is named Grizzle. Oh, I love it. I already have a voice in mind. It's going to kill my throat, but I, I have, I, I'm excited. Wildebeest are really cool. Not as cool as elephants, but pretty cool. Headlong will meet us on the other side of the great river. Look, Shepard, up ahead, a swarm of fireflies? They must be a new kind of smoke beast. Let's hope the herd doesn't attract their attention. Okay. Guide each herd to the Willoughby's tribe. Zooming in. I like these colors. These are pretty colors. Okay, so there's these firefly things. We've got... I don't know what that is. Am I supposed to... I, th I think I might be supposed to rain on it. I hope that was the answer! That was the answer. Awesome, but now I have no rain left. This one also needs to be rained on. So where do we go to get rain? There's a wellspring. So, I didn't have to rain on that thing at all! Oh, I really need to look at the whole map before I make decisions. Oh, whoa! That's, it goes really far. Okay, cool. All the way down to this. I'm assuming this is what they mean by river. I found the wildebeest! Oh, look at them! Look at their little stripies and their little floppy ears! Oh, their ears flop up and down! I love it! They're cute! My eternal refrain! They're cute! Okay, there's stepping stones. That is a resting place. That needs sand. Okay, I can do that. That feels like probably a reasonable thing to do that's not going to be a problem. It still needs rain though. This one needs to be lightning. Now I have more wind. No rain though. Oh, here's some smoke. Cinder, cinder stags. Words are hard. More hexagon spiral mist. There's a little, little teeny tiny waterfall. Okay, so smoke base over here. We went there already. Oh! Hi, Springbok friends. Oh, and we have a visitor. Hi, baby bird. You gonna come sit on Mama's lap? Nope, she's gonna sit on my footrest. Everyone say hi to the baby bird. Oh, never mind. We are coming to sit right next to Mama on the chair. Hi. 
Oh, are you going to help us play the game? We have a kitty friend. We have a kitty friend. Are you going to help us? Okay. Thank you. That would be very helpful. She says she's going to help us. Just in case you were wondering. Okay, so. I'm not sure what else I'm supposed to do, and I don't know how to get more rain. My arm is being used as a tail rest. I don't know how to get more rain. Because I feel like if these guys are fire, raining on them is like the reasonable thing to do. But I don't understand. Ah! Well, hopefully there's... Nope, I wanted to go to the elephants. So where do they need to head? They need to head. Oh, up here. That's... I can get more rain. I can get more rain. Okay. Whew. Crisis averted. Go that way. And then over here. Oh, it's a little wildebeest icon. I think that needs to be rained on. I think. Okay, I feel like that's enough for now. So let's... Nope. Elephants! <laughs> nope! <laughs> that one, okay. And they only have one route to go. Which is this way, and then to stop here. And then, if I time it right, I think I can... Not, not yet. I think I can probably get these. Fireflies. Oh no, they're coming for me. Nope. Just stop. Stop. Rain stops fireflies from flying. Okay, awesome. Good. I guessed correctly. I love it. Okay, and we're past them. Everybody celebrate. Good times. Come on. Baby bird's looking at me like I'm crazy. Yay! We did it! I wonder how Headlong is faring. Shepard, can you check on the Springbok? Okay, I will check on the Springbok. They have not moved. We only have one place for Springbok to go. And it's very far! Oh, no more kitty. She left. Or. Er do we stop there, or do we stop here? Uh, we'll find out, I guess. And then, if I can use wind on these guys, I sh again, I think this is a timing thing. Now go, okay. Now... Run that way. Oh no, no, why didn't it work? No, 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 go, go the other way. Go the, no, no, go the other way, go the other way, go the other way, go the other way. Go the other way. No, why isn't it working? Go, go, no, where? Okay, I, hold on, I'm gonna revive. There's a dead spring block here, so I would like to revive you. Go, go, be with your friends. Be with your friends. Oh, 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 yikes. I don't know what happened there, but apparently we made pollution. I'm confused with this game. Okay, so. No, oh my god, no, oh my god. No, oh my god, what's happening? Shit, fuck, what's happening? Okay, uh, let's move quickly. We can go here. It's the same, but it's just stopping. There's a rest point in the middle. Okay, hold on. Oh shit, I'm out of rain, fuck. 
Okay, we'll go the rest point way then, because there's... Oh my god. This is very stressful. Nope, 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 why? No, why are you crossing water? What is happening? And why do they keep exploding? How do I make them not explode? Oh god, I don't know if I should use this lightning or not. No wildebeest already crossed the gorge? Looks deep. Strong current. Shepherd, the herd can't cross this easily. Best if we don't have to swim long distances. Okay. Well, you, there's stepping stones, so hopefully you don't. Oh, uh, I don't, I don't know how to like. Yeah, there's stepping stones. Why would you go the direction that's not the stepping stones? Obviously, gonna do the one with stepping stones. Oh, sh I just remembered. I can use the earthquake thingy to stun them. Oh my god. <sighs> There's too many things to keep in my brain. So many things to keep in my brain. Okay, I don't see why there would be a problem with these guys getting there. But I'm worried that it's gonna like trigger something and that I won't be able to get back. So, I'm just gonna stand here and watch them go. Oh, the sand, I forgot about the sand. I forgot about the sand. Shit. Sand. There, I made their lives easier. You're welcome, spring box. I guess maybe not that much easier if they're working against the wind. Oh. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what's happening. About time. Oh, your friend's not here yet. I'll wait. I don't know what that was. Oh, no. I said I was going to think about it. I did not think about it. Okay, look at all my animal friends. Okay, so now we're done with Springbok. We do elephants. Elephants, what are our... We have to go through these brambles. Okay. So we have to go through the brambles. We have to stop there. No, we don't stop there. And do we just go all the way? Apparently, we just go all the way after the brambles. Okay. Do you think if I time this right, I can set the cinder beast, the cinder stags on fire in the brambles? Maybe? No. But setting them on, setting the, the cinder stags being on fire is bad. So we won't do that. I don't have any rain. And then I guess it's just timing. Guys, go that way, go that way, go that way, go that way, go that way. No! Be stunned, be stunned, be stunned. My one, oh no, my one baby. Come on, buddy. You can do it, you can do it. You can make it, I believe in you. Okay, she's coming, she's coming. They're all coming. Okay. And I don't have to worry about you guys swimming. Do I, I don't have any rain, so I can't do that. Oh no, we're losing energy. Oh no, guys, you can walk on that. No, guys, you can walk on land. Oh no, did I make it worse? Shit, fuck. Did I make it worse? Please be okay. Please be okay, elephant friends. Please be, no, 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 no. Okay, okay. I didn't lose an elephant, okay. I can live, I can live in peace. <laughs> Yay, we made it! Poof! Look at all my animals together! 
It's that time again, isn't it? Bit late, aren't we? Wait, who? <clears throat> Wasn't expecting a youngster in charge. Old shaman dead then. My grandmother returned to the earth before the last rains, and my mother before her. I leave now. You must be Grizzle. Grandmother told me stories about your strength, but not your forthrightness. Did she now? Suppose I'm part of quite a few tales these days. <gasps> Grizzle, I just noticed Grizzle has a scar. Look at the eye scar. Oh, that's so cool. I love it. This would be my third pilgrimage. My last two, more likely than not. Shame our tribe can't join you this time. The wildebeests have never declined in the past. What prevents you from coming? These damn spirits, they won't leave us wildebeests alone. Oh my, I can just feel how throat my, how sore my throat is going to be tomorrow. <laughs> they can be quite a bit of trouble when they get entangled with the herd. I can't just up and leave the others. I have to find a way to keep them at bay. Shaman, we can help, right? If we can create barriers so the spirits can't sense the herd to keep them safe, would that convince you to join us? <laughs> Doubt a youngster could do much. But you're welcome to try. Grizzle. Level completed! Yay, good job. Oh my god. I, um, I have some regrets regarding my decision to voice all of these characters differently. So, uh, yeah. That's, I don't know, but, but we did it, and we met the Willoughby's, and I kind of love Grizzle. I don't know anything about them yet, but I kind of love them. I, this the eye scar is just a really fun touch that I think is very cute. So let's. I think we have time to do one more. This episode. Which again, I sincerely hope we're still fucking recording. Oh my god. Okay. Yeah, I think we're gonna do one more this episode. So Grizzle's challenge: a group of wildebeest has been separated from the herd and trapped in a ravine. Excuse me, filled with cinder stags and fireflies. Grizzle will join the pilgrimage if you can help them. Well, here's the situation. A number of my tribe have been trapped in this blasted ravine for days. Oh no! There's nowhere to rest and not much to eat. Not to mention the place's crawling smoke beast. If you can get my comrades to safety and block off the exit, that would be enough to convince me to join the pilgrimage. So, Shepard, think you can help? Well, we're gonna try. I need to make so- I'm gonna have so much tea with honey when I'm done with this. So much. Oh my god. Yeah. Next time. Not gonna fucking make that decision. Okay, that's a wellspring. So we should do something with that. I can't tell if that's sand or. Yes, we have extra. So if I make the wrong decision here, it'll be okay. Okay, that was that was sand, so that's good. And now we have rain. We have a wellspring there. Oh, oh, I bet I can trap them on the other side if I time it correctly. Okay, so we'll keep that in mind. Um, got another cinder beast. I don't see anywhere to rest. Hold on, yeah. Guide the wildebeest to safety. Block off the ravine to keep the wildebeest safe. Okay. That looks like it just needs to be rained on. Fingers crossed. Okay, that was right. Oh, look at the butterflies. Or I don't know if they're butterflies or not, but in my head they're butterflies. I'm gonna hold on lightninging that until I know what else we're working with. I really would like if we could zoom out more. Okay, and that's the end point. I guess nowhere to rest means we have to do this all in like one fell swoop. Let's 
Let's check. Yeah, it's one fell swoop. Okay, that complicates things because it means I'm gonna have to do it live. Which I don't really want to do. But it is what it is. Okay. Now we have a couple earthquakes so I can I have a couple stuns on hand. Oh! Oh! If I get these rocks, it'll flood that cinder beast. Or Cinder Stag. And then you would think they probably can't cross the river. Cinder Stag explode in deep water. Okay. But it's not in water right now. It's just blocked off. Okay, so yeah, I think the same situation here. And we'll just have to, like, get them while they're on the right side. Yeah, stay on that side. I know everybody- everybody stay on that side! I didn't say you could move yet! Don't- don't walk in there. No, that's not what I wanted! I just wanted you to be trapped over there! I try so hard, y'all! Okay, so that's those guys taken care of. The fireflies, I guess we can rain on them when it's time to pass them. I think we should probably... Oh no, that's my last lightning. So I'm not sure about that. I'm not so sure about that. And then block off these guys. I'm kind of unclear as to what we're meant to... Oh! Okay, so after, after the wildebeest pass through, I can use this. So I'll save. I'll. I have to save something in for that. So after the wildebeest pass through, I can block that off. We're only after, right? Yeah, block off the ravine to keep them safe. So after they've found safety. Okay. Okay, I think we have a plan, y'all. Thinking out loud. Sometimes it helps. And I think we should probably move some sand. We have lots of wind, so that would be helpful. But I guess I need that wind. What did that do to the fireflies? It's like scrambled them? Okay, let's try it. Let's do it live. I hate that phrasing. We're doing it live. I say that shit all the time on set. And I'm like, I get it, but also I hate it. And let's continue to pull you far away. Oh good, I think that worked. Okay, I think we're out of the woods there. I think. Oh, I didn't pay attention to how many wildebeest there are. I probably should have done that. Okay. Let's move some sand. Make their lives a little bit easier. And just remembering to keep an earthquake in in the bag. Well, the bees can cross water. That is good news. So, you guys, I would like you to go in that direction. And you guys, I would like to go in this direction. No, 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 no. That's not what I said to do. That's not what I said to do. I just want those two stuff. Shit. Fuck. Shit. Oh, 
This is like complicated. Go, 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 go. No, don't you fucking dare. Raining on the cinder stacks. Will Beast, go, go, go. Go while you can. Run while you can. Run. Run. Okay. My babies. They're on their way through. Okay, and my last babies are good. So we'll explore the mountainside. <gasps> Did I do it? Was that it? did it together. Not bad, shaman. I'm impressed. So the wildebeest tribe will be joining us. Of course. No need to stand around lag yapping like hyena. We've been tracking the zebra tribe trying to join their herd until these spirits pass. We should run into them before we reach the mountains. You can tell me about our magic bird friend on the way. We've already collected our offering. Let's be off. You received an acacia. acacia. A I think it's acacia. You received an acacia thorn. Yay! I love Grizzle. I kind of love Grizzle. Okay, level completed. Grizzle's challenge. We guided the wildebeest to safety and blocked off the ravine to keep them safe. I think that is going to where I'm going to end this episode. Um, hopefully we don't... Actually, you know what? We're probably going to get thrown into another cutscene. So we're going to do that and then we're going to end the episode. Just just checking. Just checking. I uh I do not trust this game right now. Oh, okay. So there is no cutscene. All right, in that case, yes. I am going to end this episode here. Next time, we will pick up and say hello to the zebras. Um, but for now, Thank you to all my old friends for watching and to my new strangers. I think if you sat around this long, I can consider you one of my friends. So I will see you all next time. Bye.